What's up guys? Lindsay here with Little Helpful Files. This week we skipped our mini um, savings challenge on Monday. So I'm coming in with a little random video, some happy mail, and I'm gonna do a small stuffing. If you are new here, we do mini savings challenges, sinking funds, cash budgeting, and a little bit of life in general, all through the glory and by the grace of God, who I owe everything to. Um, and we're gonna go ahead and get started. All right, so I did an order from Elba. Um, her Etsy shop is Unique Finds by Beta. Um, I'm going to put it up here because I know there's a number I'm forgetting. But you can shop these on her Etsy shop. Um, she does like one of each of them. So if you see it and you love it, you got to snag it. And I'm going to go ahead and open this. I have not opened it yet. I did cut it just to make it easy because I didn't want to be fumbling with scissors. Um, so we're going to open this and then we're going to do a little mini stuffing with it. I took a little bit of the money um, from the savings challenge amount that I was going to do this week. And then we'll do the full amount next week. So this week's going to be a little low. Next week we'll have a little bit more. But let's go ahead and see. I'm so excited to see this. I did not open it or look at it. So I've been waiting. Ooh, look how cute. It looks like there might be some little freebie in here too. Um, oh man. All right, let me get this opened up. Oh, this is so adorable, guys. Oh, she put lots of little freebies. How cute. Oh, look at all these stickers. Okay, and then let me look at this last <laughs> because that's what I'm most excited about. Oh, she added in some little envelopes. That is cute. Oh, I'm so excited. Okay, so now they, these are little cash envelopes. These, though, are going to go with this little mini binder. Oh, I believe these are little bookmarks that come with it, too. How cute. Thank you, Elba. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Make sure you go check out her YouTube channel and her Etsy shop. Um, and then this, look how sweet this is, guys. It's so adorable and so cute. All right, so this is the little mini envelope challenge. Oh, I'm so excited. I might have it. Do I have it upside down? Let's flip it. <laughs> look at how pretty this is. So I am really excited. Oh, I love it. I love the pinks and the greens. You know, those are like my colors. Um, she did such a good job on this. Very, very adorable. All right, guys. So essentially what I'm going to do is... I think I'm going to do the, I was going to do the 25 week savings challenge. So we're going to go ahead. I took a little bit out of here. So we've got 20, nope, not 20, 42. So we're going to put a 20 in here and I'm going to get a little Sharpie to just color this in. So we're going to go ahead and do one. Oh, I always get the one that is too light. Hopefully you guys can see it. Now I'll probably, um, I'll probably just keep this in my sinking fun binder. So we'll go ahead and stuff one of those. Look at that. Oh, I love it. And then you can just put this on. I love, um, how cute and compact this is guys so make sure that you check out her channel uh, adorable love it thank you thank you thank you um, all right let's set that over there and then I do want to go ahead and stuff the rest of this real quick um, before I do that so I think I hadn't shown you guys this before um, so red to black budgeting Johanna um, sent me this and I have actually been loving it. So I just wanted to show it to you guys because I don't know that I ever really like actually opened it and showed it to you. The Amazing Grace Promise Book. You can get this on Amazon for like $5 and I, you know, I'm not an affiliate or anything like that. I just want to share this with you because this is something so convenient to have like in your purse or in your car. And what it is, is these little Bible verses like great little snippets that are pulled out and also quotes from other people um, on certain pages and so you can kind of go through if you are needing something um, 
like let's say that you're out and you just you need to hear the word of god right so let's go to 68 whoops 68 right so you've got some scripture here um, Jesus answered, it is written, man shall not live on bread alone, but on every word that comes from the mouth of God. Matthew 4, 4, you know, sometimes you just might need to hear a, a little bit of scripture, a little bit of God's living word to help guide you in whatever you're going through. And it might be easier to bring this than to bring your Bible, um, depending on what size or what kind of Bible you have. So I just wanted to share this with you guys. Um, I absolutely love this. And I think it is a really great gift. So if it's, you know, if something that maybe you um, want to look into for the holidays coming up, I might be doing kind of like a little video for gift ideas too. Um, just for some of the things that I've found over the last couple months that I'm really enjoying and loving. So there's that. I'm shedding. There's my hair. Okay. So now what I want to do is, because I don't want to get behind... Um, we're going to go ahead and do $20 in the Sew in Peace. So this is our September Savings Challenge Bible verse. Now I've had some questions with you guys um, just wanting to make sure you understand how this works. So I have these on the Etsy, Etsy shop. You can um, purchase this in the A7 or the A6, which is a little bit bigger. Now you can pick up with any month that you want to get started, right? It goes from January to December. Each month has its own Bible verse, and then you would color in as you save. I also, in that set, have included just Bible verse savings challenge as the title in case you just want to use this like randomly. So you can kind of get the option within that pack that you can do monthly savings challenge and follow along with like what I'm doing, or you can do random Bible verse savings challenges or you could keep one so let's say you want to keep the september savings challenge and maybe give the other like bible verse savings challenge to someone else that you know that might be getting into cash budgeting um, the cash envelope system uh, i think that's a really cool way to get somebody else you know involved um, and share you know this whole process and how it works so today we're going to put in 20 here i hope that that clears up maybe some questions um some of y'all might have had because um, you know, again, I don't know that I ever really fully explained it the way that I should have. <laughs> um, and I should probably have a highlighter. I have liked doing these with the lamination, but honestly, I don't know if I'm going to keep laminating them because it just takes up so much time and I got to get a highlighter. And I've all also noticed that like my one envelope's already starting to split. Um, and so, yeah, I... I'm just gonna do it this way. I kind of like it. it, makes it easy. All right, now we've got two of those colored in. So, so peacemakers who sow in peace reap a harvest of righteousness. All right, we are putting that in. And I'm going to do the other $2 in here. So I'll show you guys what I was talking about. Um, I don't know if you can see it, but like my donut envelope, do you see that? See how it's splitting? And I tried to cut it like far, you know, further out, like I cut it past that like seam. Um, I don't know, I still didn't do a good job. So <laughs> anyway, it's always a learning with those laminators, man. I'm telling you that whole process. So we're putting two in here and I'm gonna color this in. Let's do boop, blue. And like I said, guys, this was a portion of what um, I would have stuffed this past Monday, even though I didn't get a chance to, and I will be sharing more about our weekend in the next video. This one was just kind of a quick video I wanted to get uploaded to show you guys the happy mail and have you guys go and support her. So that will be it for now, and make sure that you tune in next Monday for my next savings challenge video. I hope that you all have a wonderful day, and may God continue to bless you. See you next time.